All right, guys, welcome back to another episode on the Lionheart server. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're all doing fantastic. We are trying out a new setup today. I've got a dual PC setup. So I'm basically streaming and recording through another computer and then just allow my gaming computer to just game. So if there are any issues going on with the video, I please forgive me. I'm trying to get this all dialed in. But today, guys, we're going to be doing a bit of uh, repair work, enchanting, and checking out everything. Are we actually out of diamonds? Like 100%? I think we are. Okay, so we'll have to do something else later. Um, but let's go, because we are now currently in 1.14.3, as you can see from the top left. And so let's have a look here. Let's see. As you can tell, some of the, the, um, the textures for all the stuff have changed. Let's have a look. You just wanted to see... So I think they've boosted the contrast of the stone blocks, if I'm not mistaken. And the stone bricks. And the site looks a little different. Uh, the grays in the stone block, especially on the stair, looks a little, like, washed out. I could be wrong, though. Um, the, the wood planks look a little bit different, that's for sure. The, the big, biggest notice I have is the stone. The stone looks a heck of a ton different. And it's weird going through caves with stone like that. But one thing that is sure going to be broken is the villager farm. And as you can see, yeah. So a good way we might be able to sneak around this is if we replace this block with, uh, or underneath the carpets with their respective uh, things. I'll have to do some research on who's who. Um, but this is, looks like a librarian, so we'll have to see about what's for him and stuff like that. Oh, Scoozy joined the game. Very cool. Okay, so I think I have a few things that we need to test out. Uh, so I've been going through, and I'm like, okay, we need a smithing table. We need a loom. I don't, I don't, I have no idea what these things do. Uh, so smithing table, a loom. Uh, I think these are just for. Oh, this is not just for villagers. I think this is just for villagers, but this is not. Um, or it might be. I don't know. I don't know. But I've been looking through here, and a smoker, we need one of these. Compositor, I've never used this before. Uh, let's see. Oh, a cartography table. Yep, going to grab that. Oh, the lantern. I got to place it. I got to place it. I know exactly where. Oh, man. That looks so good. Let's see. Um... Did that place it in there? Yeah, buddy. Man, I like the lantern. I also want to do a campfire. I want to go over to the um, the castle base and uh, do some work on the butcher's shop with the new campfire. So a barrel here. I love barrels. Uh, I've seen some people use those recently. Um, here is the campfire. There we go. Okay. And then a crossbow. Let's load it up. <laughs> That's awesome. So it seems something's up. Uh, I don't know how to make the blast furnace, honestly. Um... Yeah, I'm not 100% sure. Might be a combination of things. I'll have to look up how to make it. But for right now, I want to I want to test this stuff out. Cartography table, compositor, barrel. Oh, that is so good. Look at the smoke effects. You can hide these in chimneys now, and the smoke effects will go out of it. Oh man, that's so awesome. The barrel is just like a the chest. If you put anything in it, will it keep it or will it just drop it? It drops it. Okay, so it just looks cool. It just looks cool. But I do like it. It's a compositor. I don't know what that's for. And then a cartography table. Plus fences. Nope, not fences. Uh, I bet you there, if you got ink, it'll do it. Let's have a look here. I don't have any ink. That's weird. Oh, well, but I think that's what you do. Smoker. Smoke potato. Well, that's freaking fast. 
baked potato. That's changed. That that that's changed the appearance of that. But anyway, I want to grab this guy. Oh, <gasps> you can't break the campfire. There's no sitting around the campfire and singing the campfire song. What is this? Okay. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and make another campfire while we're here. Dang it. Okay. And let's head over to the castle base. All right, people. So I just watched Sweeney Dunstan's video on the blast furnace, and I am determined to make one. So we're going to make one. Now, I didn't realize how easy it was to make this because I'd never seen the recipe. But look, there's the blast furnace. And let's give it a test. So we'll throw some charcoal in there. Do we have anything to cook up? Uh, maybe, yeah, rock pork chop. Okay. Oh, this is for ing or ingots and stuff like that. Yeah, so I got some, I got some iron ore. We can smelt up. Okay, now let's put a normal fur knight next to it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So it's about twice as fast. I'm a big fan of that. I like that a lot. I'm not going to lie. Uh, we'll definitely be putting that in the blacksmithing table, or the smithing table in the blacksmithing shop. That's what we're going to be building here. I dropped my phone. Okay, phone is undropped, meaning I picked it up. So let's go ahead. We're going to leave those smelting. I'm going to go over to the uh, to the actual castle base like we were supposed to originally, and we're going to have some fun. All right, peoples, we are here at the butcher shop. And as you can see here, we uh, we have something. Uh, so this is supposed to be a chimney and like, a, like you know, like you cook stuff. But uh, we're going to do a little bit of redesign on this bad boy. Because I, I was watching B-double-O's video. It's funny, there's rotten flesh in there. I was watching B-dub's video and I saw what he did and I was just freaking floored by it. Uh, so we're just going to have one of these here. And I believe it was like this. Shoot, missed. Yeah. So like that, we're gonna try to make a little pocket for it. It's cool, it stays there. It looks like it's cooking stuff. And... You know what, I wanna bring these into one more block. I'll have to look at his, because this looks a little different. And I really like the look of it, but this is what we're going with for now. I don't know, should I fill that in, or should I leave it? Maybe, maybe that's good, maybe it's not. But we need to get up upstairs. And to do that, oh man, we have to pillar up with, with actual these guys. Okay, so let's get over to here. If we're going to fill up, we're going to fill up on this side. And all we're doing... Is yes, we already have fire going. But it's not good to fire. We need raging fire. Okay. So there's that. That is exactly what I wanted. Okay. We're gonna leave the middle open so you can see it from the floor. Let's have a look. That looks so cool. I'm not gonna lie, cause it doesn't look like it's like on fire, it just looks like there's smoke coming from it. That is so awesome. I still need to do some terraforming. 
and go around this place. I actually might uh, put something here and loop it around over here like that. I don't know. But it is really coming together, guys. Oh, I like it so much. And this doesn't look half bad, either. But look at that. It's got a little furnace. Okay, so I'm going to talk to you guys about this base, this house a little bit. I plan on having, like, a pub down here. You know, where you go uh, on, a, on a Friday night, you go down here and you have some fun. And then there's some houses here. Like, people actually live here. And then I want to make, I want to turn that into an actual tower. Um... Like, this will be the gate to get into the castle area. And then over here, we're going to put a, a wall going. Probably, like, something like this between the oh, between the tower and then over here. And then I'm going to try to get some help from other people on the, on the server. Uh, I would honestly like to knock this whole thing out. This whole little island thing. Uh, knock that out. Uh, and then build a dock. And we'll have to have... We'll have to kind of build it around this. It might have to come out, like, here... And then have like a little thing that goes out for the dock. I'm going to get some um, inspiration, stuff like that from old medieval docks. I'm going to do some research on it and see what we got. We also need to put a sail on it. But because it's docked, I think we need to have them rolled up. And we need to make these masts a little bit bigger. So that is that for the boat. It's pretty neat, huh? How neat is that? And uh, next episode, I think I want to start on the windmill and uh, the wheat fields. Uh, which I don't know if I've I, I don't know if I've spoke about before, but I have this gate over here, which I need to redo because I'm just not a fan of it. Um, yeah, we're gonna redo this gate. This is gonna be let's see, let's see what direction are we facing? Uh, facing so this is gonna be the west gate, and this is going to be the all of this in here is gonna be the wheat fields. I want like almost everything you can see to be wheat, not like up on the hills, but on the floor. And then, like, right around here, we're going to have a path kind of snaking through the wheat fields. And then we're going to put, like, a windmill, like, right here. And it's, I think it's going to look great. And we're going to have a whole bunch of um, whole bunch of wheat around it. Uh, I don't want any potatoes or carrots like that because wheat is just, I think it'll look better once it's all fully grown. This tree, you are a no-no. Get bad tree. You're done. So that's the goal for this. And then... I would like to, like, tuck away a potato and carrot farm in, like, one of the hills and do see if we can still make the old villager uh, carrot and potato farm work. Uh, but this is the pathway back. And I was building this while I was watching Game of Thrones, and they were walking on paths, so I thought it was pretty cool. But then I look at it now, and I'm like, ah, this isn't all that cool. Like, this over here, this needs to be worked on. I need to add in some variety to this path because it's just a path block, and I don't think it looks all that good. And then over here, I don't know what I'm going to put on top of this hill, if I'm being honest. I really don't. I think, like, a cathedral might be kind of cool to put on top of it. Um, but I, I'm not sure. They put the Temple of Time for Zelda or something like that. Like, a, like inspiration from it. But yeah, this is the kingdom area. Uh, I got a lot of pretty cool plans for it. I want to put the blacksmithing shop either here or right in here. Uh, we're going to do the smithing table and stuff like that. It's going to be like two levels. So we're going to have an entrance down here. And then we're going to have one up top too. Which I think will be awesome. And I don't want it to be like a square building. Uh, we're probably going to tear this down and put a different type of building there eventually. But I'm going to keep it for a while because that's where the bed and all the storage is. And then we got to do a lot of, a lot of freaking work to the, to the keep I think it's called. I don't know. I don't, I'm not sure. But the castle part. Uh, I did start on it a few episodes ago. You guys... Like, no one really seemed to like it. Um, so I'll have to restart it. That's where I got all my beacons. My beacons. I did a little bit of work off camera. I like the bottom, but I don't like the, the middle part with the wood. I just don't think I implemented the wood correctly. So, but yeah. Uh, let me see how much time we have left for the video, and we'll be right back. Let's test this thing out. So I, I, I bet you could probably put some enchantments on this, if I'm not mistaken. So he's dead. Oh shoot. And you're good at strafing. Got him. 
<laughs> Not that good. Okay, so I need to practice with this thing. What's going on over there? Oh, oh man. Oh man, 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 oh man. Hey, no. I are you not entertained? Oh shoot. Got to go. Ha! That's it. You're getting it. Hiya! Want some of this? Okay, you got some of that. <sighs> They've got their bows trained up. Are they across? Now they're moving. Now they're not moving. Oh, they're shooting! They're shooting! You wanna go? Need to heal up. Oh, they're mad. They're angry. They're salty senoritas. That guy's got a freaking sword. The night sucks! The night has always sucked! Get out of here, creeper. Ah! You! Get out of here with your stupid enchanted bow. They're on to us, boys. We're out. Okay, let's go sleep real quick, and then we'll go take them on. I don't want to die, because I have 88 levels, and that's the whole reason I was at the, the pigment farm for so long. Okay. Let's see if we can do this. Okay, we did clip a little bit there. I want to test that. Ahoy, mateys. Let's go. Okay, let's see here. These fools are over here, huh? Yeah. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. That's it. That's pretty easy. That's pretty easy. Let's see where they at though. Hey spider. That is not where you belong. So there seems to be one left over here. Oh that's a zombie villager. Your butter armor won't save you now. Okay. They were over here, huh? This is where they spawned. Interesting. Is that a cave? No, it's not. I thought that was a cave going down. <laughs> oh, well. That's pretty fun. First run in with the Illagers. Neat. Yeah, dead. Okay, so I think I'm going to wrap up the episode for today, guys. Next episode, I want to start working on the windmill. I'm excited. I'm going to be looking at some tutorials, uh, some old medieval things. We're also going to fix this. I need to have some looks at what people are doing. But anyways, guys, I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. But guys, this has been the Super Turtle, and I'm full of arrows. You guys have a great day. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.